here I am with my girl Emma. My name is Cindy Bernicke and this is Emma the Emu. And uh, she has infatuation with my ponytail. We'll give her some crackers instead. Anyway, we're coming to you from the Wear Pigs Fly Farm out in Lynn, Missouri. And our All About series uh, today, of course, is gonna be all about emus. I think you're gonna be uh, fascinated with some of the facts that uh, you learned today. Uh, emus are really incredible animals, so stay tuned and here we go. Well, here we go with the facts. The emu is native to Australia, which is where it still resides, pretty much everywhere throughout Australia, except in the rainforest. The male emu is known as the cock, the female the hen, and the baby the chick. Now the emu will live anywhere from 10 to 20 years, however in captivity they may live up to 35. Now they can weigh anywhere between 40 and 132 pounds, generally though they're between 70 and 80 pounds, and they'll get up to 6 and a half foot tall. The emu dads are some pretty incredible guys. The female should lay 5 to 15 eggs. However, once those are laid, she takes off. It is up to the male to incubate these eggs. And it takes about 52 days, which is quite a while to be sitting on the nest. Now the emu has some really cool looking eggs. They weigh between 1 and 1.4 pounds and are generally 5 inches by about 3.5 inches. They're huge. And like I said, it is the dad that is sitting on these eggs, and he does not eat during this incubation time. He loses about one-third of his body weight. Now this guy should get father of the year. This is a pretty cool poster showing dad with his kids. Babies are about five inches tall when they're born, about 18 ounces, and they stick around with dad for about 18 months. They're actually full grown at about two years and ready to start families of their own. Now this is Emma when she first came home and still had her stripes. Once the babies hit about three months old, unfortunately those stripes disappear, but they're still beautiful. Now although the emu is the largest bird in Australia and the largest bird at the Werepigs Fly Farm, it is the ostrich that is the largest bird in the world. Now with these big powerful legs that she loves to show off, they can actually run up to 30 miles per hour. Now not only do they love to run, but they also love to swim and play in mud. One thing you may not know is that the emu has two eyelids, one to keep sand out, the other to blink with. They are also known for their good eyesight and hearing. This really comes in handy along with their size and their speed. It really reduces their predators. The only ones they really have to worry about are humans, gators, and wild dogs. Humans use the emu for the skin, feathers, meat, and oil. However, since they're farmed now, there's really no need to hunt them as much. Something else you may have noticed about the emu is that its wings are missing. Well, it does have teeny tiny wings. However, they're pretty much useless when it comes to flight for this poor bird. And like the caveman, the emu is nomadic. That means it eats, enjoys, and then it moves on. They're omnivores. And that means that they love plants and animals. They eat fruit, bark, nuts, seeds, tiny reptiles, and little mammals. They have quite an appetite. Now, similar to a chicken, the emus have a gizzard. With the gizzard, they have to consume tiny pebbles in order to make the gizzard work. And this is how they process their food. Emus also drink a ton of water, about two and a half to five gallons a day. Now they're said not to be social, though curious. Though I have to argue, I think our little girl Emma is very social, especially when you have crackers. Now as sweet as she is, she can be a little intimidating with those dinosaur looking feet with talons that cut like knives. Despite this power, emus are not known to kill humans or to even fight with them. Crazy fact, the emus are the only birds that have calf muscles. And those three toes, they actually have fewer bones and muscles than regular flight birds. However, you will not see a flight bird dance like this. Along with being an incredible dancer, those powerful legs, they can stride up to nine feet. And they have a jump of up to seven feet. Well, with all that running, jumping, and dancing, she does have to get her sleep. In order to sleep, the emus sit down. 
They will sleep for about seven hours. However, like some humans, they are up and down throughout the night to get stuff to eat and go to the restroom. Now, I'm not sure if all emus are the same, but Emma loves to have her back scratched. And on a personal note, I have to say, emus are simply awesome. That pretty much wraps it up. Uh, here we are again. And uh, Emma's definitely more interested in the crackers than anything. Anyway, hopefully you learned a lot. Uh, if you enjoyed this, uh, please hit that subscribe button. And we're going to tell you all about the rest of the farm animals here. If there's a particular animal that you'd like to learn about, uh, please put that in the comments below. Or if you have any other questions about emus, uh, please let us know. Uh, also, uh, if you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Oh, and there goes Emma. And uh, also, please hit that little bell and you'll make sure that uh, you are notified when we have additional videos coming out. Thank you so much for supporting us. Remember, by subscribing and watching our videos, you are the ones that help take care of these babies. And we greatly appreciate it.